Hey everybody, I'm sure you've already heard by now, um, got, got some new toys. Uh, last week I had ordered, last Thursday as a matter of fact, I had ordered a couple of the new Volcas. I got the Volca sample and I ordered the Volca FM and some various other stuff. Well, they told me that the Volca was going to be back ordered until mid-May or that it wouldn't come in until mid-May. So I was like, okay, but they went ahead and sent everything else out. I did an unboxing video. Well, yesterday I received an email from Sweetwater again, and they said they had shipped my package. And, of course, you know, I have to sign for it, but I was at work, so I couldn't sign for it. So I actually had to come and get it. Um, I had to drive to one of their shipping centers and pick it up. So it showed up today. First, I thought it was an April Fool's joke, and I haven't opened it yet, so it still could be, but... Here it is from Sweetwater, uh, and in case you're wondering, I am still sitting in the FedEx parking lot because um, I'm pretty anxious, so I'm going to go ahead and open it up, and uh, let's see what we've got. I'm going to do an unboxing right here in my car, <laughs> so here we go. All right, so here we have the package. And it's from Sweetwater. Let me get my keys out here and this. Oh, I just honked my horn. So let's see here. All right, what do we got here? Once again, I have the thank you card, and uh, I'm sure inside we've got, yep, I got my receipt. Some more candy. Volca FM. So let's see what we have. This is going to be the shakiest video ever because I'm trying to open a box with one hand and uh, videotape with the other. So Okay, now I got it open. I had to readjust. So let's see what we get. All right, so we get a parameter list card here with all of the uh, the parameters for the Volca FM, which, judging by the layout, it looks to me as if this is very similar to the DX7. Now, I'd heard that it was going to be like the DX7, and it would even load sysx commands. So, sure enough, there's the algorithm chart that comes with it. Here is the instruction manual. requisite batteries and the patch cable Tada show enough the cork Volca FM it has all the layouts necessary for parameter adjustments it's got the speaker in the back, the battery compartment. There's the patch, the MIDI. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have some fun with this. All right, so there it is. Probably the most low-tech, shakiest uh, unboxing video you've ever seen, but this is what happens when you get a guy who gets excited about his toys. So um, stay tuned, I will have a quick sound demo of the Volca FM and then I'm going to see if I can get a series of things going with the sample, the FM, my microbrew, and today I also got, which I didn't need to sign for, which I think is silly, um, but it came from a different location and I bought it off eBay. Um, I got a Korg Chaos Pad, one of the KP2s. 
Uh, I got that today. I have not had a chance to plug it in. I have opened it already, but since it's older technology, I'm not worried about the unboxing. And I have a Volca Keys on the way. Um, the estimated ship date is Monday, April 4th. So it was not an April Fool's joke. I did get my Evolca FM today, so I'm pretty excited. And when I get the Volca keys in, I'm not going to do an unboxing because I bought it used. Um, but I am going to set it up. I'm going to see if I can get um, something going with all three of those pieces. The Chaos Pad and my Microbrew. And maybe my iPad if I can get it all hooked up. So we'll see what happens. So but once again... Thanks, Sweetwater, for hooking me up and getting me set up with my Volcas. I really appreciate it, and uh, we'll see you next time.